Hey, welcome to Law Talk. This is the Chicago version tonight. <laughs> Myself with Buck Malakowski are here to talk about the current events, the presidency, and the Department of Justice. Mark, how are we doing tonight? Well, I'll tell you. Uh, there's a whole new scam going on. And what scam then would that be? It's a wonderful scam. It's called Hit Hitler's Hit, I mean, not Hitler, Holder, excuse me, <laughs> Holder's Hit Team. Well, that's a slip of the subconscious on that one, wasn't it, Mark? <laughs> that's a Freudian slip I ever did. Well, okay, Holder's Hit Team. And who would that be? Okay, well, the thing is, they did everything that, you know, the re-education part, they audited people, they crushed their business, but that still didn't stop people. People still wanted to vote, people still wanted free speech. They're just pesky, 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 right? So now they're turning the screws, and now what they've got is this anti-terrorism, domestic terrorism squad. It's going to be run by Holder, and uh, it's going to be the DOJ, Department of Justice, the FBI, and the U.S. Attorney. And what they're going to do, now these people have guns. and they've well, Wait got, a minute, i got, got a question for that. But these aren't generally the organizations. They're only selected political appointees to the Out organization. Of, yeah, sure. Yeah, so that would mean that it would actually follow the trend of the current administration, wouldn't that be what Eric Holder's whole idea here was? Well, the thing about Eric Holder, what the what the thing, what the thing about this domestic anti-terrorism, first of all, they're going to go after um, people with anti-government animus. Heaven forbid, who so, would that be? So anybody who criticizes the government that's anti-government -an animus. Would okay. that be law talk? <laughs> well, we're Whoa! Gonna, no, but we figured out a way around it. We've got a loophole for that, okay? Do we have an inside? Uh, our man? mouthpiece has figured out a loophole on that. We'll tell you about them in a minute. And there's also people who are like racially prejudiced, okay? So this racially prejudiced. This hit team. Are gonna, you telling me that that still exists in America today? Well, the, basically, what Holder says is anyone who criticizes him or President Obama is racially prejudiced. Must be a racist. No, he said that. Oh. Okay. So anyone basically who criticizes the president or the attorney general is a bigot. Okay. And they're going to go after them. Now, what's interesting about this hit team is they're not just going to use the regular weapons that police use, like pistols and machine guns and stuff like that. What they're going to do is because, like, the war on terror has been won, they're going to take all that artillery that they're using overseas, they're going to use it domestically. Well, what I understand is they're shipping back all the equipment from Afghanistan and, and they're bringing their bring, and Iraq, and then what they're doing is they're putting it on the streets. And, on the street. and But this will be a specialty unit. This won't be your average police force. It'll be a force that's directed directly from Eric Holder's office. Isn't right. that the and idea? So, that's, so what they're doing is they're taking the force of the military, your article, you know, to like all that force, and they're turning the guns away from other countries where they're protecting the borders, and they're turning it on the civilians. Wait a minute, it and sounds citizens. like a violation of the Posse Comitatus Act. Well, that's just the beginning of it. Wait, right? that's the beginning. Well, where's where this going? Okay, well, the thing is, see. Holder was going after, say Holder ha has been going after the Little Sisters of Poor, the terrorist organization. I understand that. So the, the federal government's been squishing the Little Sisters of Poor because we've got to put the squeeze on them. I they're, understand they're that. Trying to move in on the minute, side. They're trying to move in on the south side. They're coming in on the south yeah, side. Yeah, the little south. The little well, wait a minute, I thought the <laughs> National Organization of Women were the one that put the <laughs> Little Sisters of the Poor on the hit list as the Dirty 100. Well, yeah, there's a little turf war. Oh, turf the little, war. Who's now actually and little, a little sister or yeah, who's not a little yeah, sister? Yeah, yeah, who's a little sister and who's a now and so, but now we're going to have the enforcers but coming. But now we'll have the yeah, enforcers. We'll, we'll, well, i got a question. Is now going to be armed as well? Or is, uh, is Holder believe that now isn't sufficient to be able to arm with military vehicles and well, weapons? Well, they'll just, they'll just take directions from now. And then they've got, and then they've got Nikula Nikula. Remember him? Nikula Nikula. Nikula Nikula was the guy who made the film that caused the Benghazi oh, attack. Oh, that's yeah. right, the Benghazi attack. And so, the oh, premeditated. Yeah, and so yeah, like yeah. they can redirect those efforts against right. that guy. They got to squish that guy. And then the other person, the biggest terrorist in the United States, the biggest threat that the United States has ever fa faced, right? Dinesh D'Souza. Hey, oh, that's oh. America. <laughs> Heaven forbid. Oh my gosh. Well, so, wait a minute. Let's so, go back to this for a minute. And now, who? How do? You, what's the qualification to be labeled a domestic terrorist? If you criticize Obama or Holder. Oh, well, wait a minute. That sounds like a short list. Yeah, well, that is. But the thing is, we don't want to be on that list. And so what we're going to do from now on, we're not going to ever criticize the president again. We can't ever. And we're not going to criticize Holder. Now, Holder, instead of calling him attorney general, which he really isn't anyway, but um, we'll just call him blind man Holder. That's not what we call him downtown. Downtown, we call him blind man. You know what we do is we <laughs> deliver those envelopes to his office. <laughs> and you know what's funny? He takes them. <laughs> 
No, but we'll call him Blind Man because he didn't ever see anything about Fast oh, and Furious. Oh, Fast and Furious never happened? No, he's never saw anything about the IRS. Oh, the IRS, hey! Oh, he What's that? There's just a lot of emails that are missing. Uh, yeah, and he never saw anything about the VA administration. Oh, the VA. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, I mean, so we just called him Blind Man. So Blind, Blind Man. Blind Man Holder, okay. Uh, but the, wait a minute. Would and then we, we got we the be on that list now? Were they, are the no, tanks we, coming in? No, we don't want to be on the list. So, what are we going to do? Be on that list. And also, we don't want to call the president the president anymore. No. Because he's not really anyway fake the election anyway. He's we, a phony president. We call him Godfather Jones. No, no, we're not going to call him that anymore. No, we're going to call him anymore. We're going to call him three card. Three card. Mob boss three card. Okay, mob boss three card. And I'm going to explain why. Why don't you show me this why mob gonna, boss three gonna, card? Okay, like, I, I'm going to tell you why we're going to call him mob boss three card. Okay, okay? I'm ready. Let me show you how this works. How does that work? Okay, well, first of all, no, wait a minute. Wait a minute. First of all, when you got when you got three cards here, right? Yeah. Okay, it's called three card money. Okay. Okay. So and who are those cards? What's that? Who's on those cards? Well, the thing is, when you're when you're when you're doing three card money, you got to look at okay, we got elections, right? Uh, that would be Romney. Okay, we That'd got be Santorum. Santorum, and we got Obama, right? And that would be the current president, Mr. Obama. Okay, so when you have an election, right? Everyone right. gets to make a choice, right. right? So here's Romney, here's Santorum, and here's Obama, right? Right. Okay. So we so have a choice there. Everyone sees, okay, this is Romney. He's basically a rich guy who's right. for the rich. Right. And believes in capitalism and believes free enterprise and believes in elections. Uh, you and mean he, he believes in the Constitution? Old-fashioned stuff. Old-fashioned guy. Uh, uh, Santorum, he's, he's kind of... He's a religious guy. Well, he's kind of the same thing, but he believes in, you know, a lot of religious stuff. A lot stuff. of religion. He's in trouble with the, the feminists. And the, yeah, I know. You know, they I don't like him. I think he said that uh, there's and, no such thing as a difference in, in uh, male or female. It's just a matter of how you choose to use your body and so anyway he's in trouble on that and then we got obama who's basically a disciple of saul well Alinsky. he's saul Alinsky, yeah saul Alinsky, and of course he's Protoche. a community organizer yeah. never had a job in his life okay so that's a, so there's your election choice here okay okay so what we do is you know that we've got we've got romney here we got santorum here and we got obama here right right and so what happens we want to have a you know you want to have a free and fair election that's so correct. nobody knows who you vote for so you know where everyone is here right, right? okay so that's how it works, okay? So are you going to show me how it works? Or? That's how that's how it works, okay? Well, let's, well, I'll, I'll show you, you how, I'll show you how it works. I think what we have to do is we have to start thinking about how does it really work? How do we deliver those envelopes? How big are those envelopes? Does it involve cash, check, or bonds? Maybe okay. a little stock here and there. Okay, so now let's take a look at this again. So, for example, we've got... Uh, we, you know, we, you, I you saw, saw those You cards. saw where they went. Okay. Yes, I did. Now we're going to switch them around a little bit. Okay. You keep track of who you want. I, okay, I you know who I want. You keep track of who you want. Okay, now pick your card there. I'm going to pick this one. Okay, pick this card. I know who card. that is. <gasps> oh, really? Oh, wait a minute. Yeah, that's, uh, not, that's not the person no, I picked. It didn't work so good. Hey, so look, look, if you're not happy with the results yeah. and you don't want to pay protection to the mob, right. just wait till the next election. Now, who's the next election? Now, wait till the next election. Okay. Are we let's, talking about let's, that let's third switch, time? Let, let's switch them around. Let's, let's try it around. again. Let's, let's try it again. Really okay, try, try, try it again. Try it again. I'm going to try that one. Try that one. That's funny. He can't run for a third term. Well, it doesn't matter. No, 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 do okay. I get a free cell phone? No, no, well, let's have another election. Try I'm going to try this one. This is the IRS run election. That's the, I want the IRS to this win the election. This is the IRS election. election. Oh, well, that's look, funny. It's the same guy. Well, it's kind of funny. Are you trying to tell well, me? Well, when the IRS runs the election, it's kind of funny. There's only one person that can win. Well, wait a minute. That's why we call him Three Card Obama. Ah, okay. you know what? Okay, no I matter who something. you vote for. It always comes up the same guy. Three Card always wins. Well, okay. that's amazing. I okay, so anyway, so that's the way that, so we got the domestic terrorists on the run now. And uh, we're moving right along. And anybody who, so we no longer want to talk about President Obama because then we've been we on can't that, talk about We're going to be on that hit list. In fact, we can't talk about him anymore or, or else we're racist mm -hmm. or we're a homophobe or every other phobe in the face of the earth that goes along with well, El well, Presidente. Is, hey, if you can't beat him, join him. Okay, and look. But uh, we don't beat him. We don't beat we him. We pay him. <laughs> we pay him. And we pay him good. Uh, okay, and now if you don't pay, and also they have a thing that they used to call the IRS, right? Right. So we're not going to call it the IRS anymore, right? What are we going to call it? We're going to call it the Keep Gangsters Bankroll. I right? like that. The KGB. KGB. So Holder is going to be blind man Holder. Blind man Holder. President President Obama would be three card Obama. Uh, three card Monty. No, three card Obama. Oh, that's right. Three, three card, card Obama. Obama. Three well, card. Listen, I suggest what we do <laughs> is we we keep this mind and we move on to our next segment. What